What's up? Hey, dude. Uh, How are you? I'm pretty good. Uh, look what I got. <laughs> I just got it uh, a few weeks ago, and uh, it was my friend's birthday, and I was getting him into the show. And uh, we actually just finished watching the season six finale. Uh, but I got this uh, as a birthday gift for him. Where did you get it? Uh, they were Is selling it- through uh, Amazon and Walmart, but it was like through a third party. So they were Amazon or Walmart. We wasn't selling them directly. But... I, I remember after the show had been canceled by NBC, uh-huh. I went because I was still part of the NBC uh, like family with the soup because it was universal. And I went to the, the store and I went to the, like the 30 rock store and they uh-huh. still had all our merchandise out. <laughs> and the person was like, yeah, we can't sell it fast enough. And I was like, but the show was canceled. And I'm like, yeah, nah. where are you? I'm from Oregon. Uh, yeah. Go, go duck. Portland, Oregon. Beavers. Portland, Oregon. Uh, uh, go Beavers then. Uh, but I, I started, uh, I actually started watching the show when it first premiered in like 2009. But oh. for some reason, I only watched like the first five or six episodes. And then I just like stopped for some reason. I don't I don't even know why. I guess like, too busy when with school did, or something. When did you rediscover it? Uh, it was after I, I was, Rick and Morty was starting to get popular. And I found out about Dan Harmon was involved with it. And then like a few months later, I re- remembered he was a part of Community. So I went back yeah. and watched uh started getting that and then i just began binge watching on hulu uh in like 2015 and then uh, i'm already on my third watch through uh with that holy friend. crap but, uh, i've been trying to, i've been trying to get other people to watch it too uh, i got i actually have a friend uh from colorado and i know the show's saying colorado but i've been trying to get him to watch it but i i haven't yet so maybe maybe you could tell him to watch it i don't know maybe yeah, that was his help. name uh, his name's uh kyle hey kyle <laughs> what's your problem why aren't you watching Community? It's easy to see now. Right. You got you got Netflix, right? Yeah. Kyle? Yeah. He's Kyle, got both. I think. You. <laughs> I mean, come on. It's time to watch it. I, it be, you're doing a disservice to us if you don't. Okay. That's what I've been saying, but maybe maybe now that he hears from you, he'll finally check it out. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I'll tell you uh, when we were shooting. So the first season was like the, the the network was interested in like they were like oh, you got to establish that it's from. Uh, Colorado and so we would shoot in this little park at Paramount and they're all palm trees uh-huh. so then we'd wrap the palm trees in these fir tree blankets that so it made them look like the bottom of fir trees and we did that for the first season and then by the third season yeah uh, we were shooting in the same park and they're like I was like didn't you guys forget to wrap the palm trees and, or, and they were like yeah don't worry about it, it doesn't matter and so we're like <laughs> okay yeah. Okay. And then, great. And then another cool thing about you is, uh, so Community and Psych are my two favorite shows, and you're part of the Psych the movie too. And I, I read that you're friends with Tim Robinson. How did you get a part of that? Uh, the movie. Uh, well, Tim, I, he is originally from Seattle, like like yeah. I am. Uh-huh. Uh Go Trailblazers, and uh, <laughs> and yeah, I was. T- uh, so the big secret it wasn't a secret, but Tim was like the most famous actor in seattle he was like the golden boy of acting in seattle because he was so handsome (laughs) so funny so such a good actor and uh, i got to know him down here and i had him on the soup a few times he was on the soup finale he's an amazingly kind soul and his wife allison is amazing and i love him and then he had that horrible stroke yeah and uh with the way our country operates sag insurance was going to run out and so uh, James Rode wrote this movie for him and they asked if I would play his dad. And I, you know, when, when they said that, I was just like, I, I'll, I'll do it for free. I'll do whatever you want. I'll <laughs> yeah. pay to do it. I'll, I, I, whatever you want, I'll do it. And so that's, I was so, I was so touched that they asked me and I'm very excited. I'm going to do as much press as I possibly can about it. Cause I'm, I love the guy. Yeah, it comes yeah. out in uh, three weeks, July 15th, I would believe. But they released like the first four minutes online, and I, I saw that. So I saw your beginning part, and you're pretty good. <laughs> oh, I'll get there. I'll get there. Uh, well, I have to. I have a bunch of guys in the queue, yeah. but uh, maybe I'll see you in um, uh, sales tax-free Portland when this shit opens up Yeah, again, I would go cause... to your live show if you ever come here. Oh, I would, <laughs> I would love to, and I love the restaurants there, and I, lo- I love Portland. It's, it's, I feel like the Northwest is the greatest part of our country. Yeah, so I agree. <laughs> uh, sorry about that rest of the country where I grew up. 
it's my roots. But um, thank you so much for being for coming tonight and yeah. and, and watching. Yeah, I've been I watched all your pod, all the darkest time my podcast so far. I'm gonna keep keep watching them. They're really God good. <laughs> bless you. God bless you, <laughs> your family, and um, your ancestors, and your future family members. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. It was uh, a right great, great meeting with you. <laughs> great to talk to you. Let's do it again, man. Thank you for All right. coming. Bye. All right. See, See you. Man. Bye.